All right, just hang in. Second edition. This time we're just hanging with Prince Fielder. Prince, we've got some hard hitting journalistic questions coming. Right. Nervous? All right, a little bit. Okay, okay. Yeah. We're going to start with some favorites. Favorite food? Okay. Uh, favorite food? Uh, I'm going to say steak. Steak? Meat, you know, meat in general. Steak, okay. Yeah. How, how do you like your steak? Uh, I like the Korean barbecue. I love that. Okay. Got that from Chew. A little yeah. Bit. And um, what else? I love a ribeye. Ribeye? Yeah. All right. Favorite movie? Um, I, you know what? As a I, you know, as a kid, it was Scarface. Yeah. You know, because I always watched that with my dad. You know, along with the Godfather. Uh -huh. But now, honestly, it's uh, uh was that Inside Out? With, yeah, 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 yeah. I think that's the coolest movie ever. <laughs> it helps with my that? emotions. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because uh, you know, you know how they do the dad. You know, the dad works only yeah. on anger. I'm like, God, I need to change. That's kind of <laughs> you know. And so, when your wife talks to you, you're thinking about something else. Yeah. So your success this year is going to be a credit to how Inside, Inside Out helped yeah, you. Yeah, it really did. There you go. Dude. All right. It really did. Uh, favorite TV show? Um, I'm going to have to say uh, Dexter. It was. Okay. Yeah. 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 Now, I heard that, is that the one that had the bad ending? Like, everyone the, loves? Yeah, where he just ended up in some, yeah, yeah. yeah. it was terrible. Okay, all right. Yeah. But you liked every other episode? Yeah, yeah, every okay. other episode. Favorite actor or actress? Uh, I like... Uh, Al Pacino, yeah, yeah. and uh, an actress, I would say, Shalise Theron. Yeah, she's Not great. Right. Yeah, no, yeah, no, me, <laughs> me neither, me neither, me neither. Uh, okay, growing up, favorite uh, sports team? Uh, for me, it was the Boston Red Sox, just because they're. I thought their jerseys were cool. Okay. And um, Mo Vaughn was on the team. Yeah. So that was. And you're a big Mo Vaughn fan. Yeah. Okay, that makes sense. Favorite athlete growing up? Uh, King Griffey Jr. Um, not, you know, not really because of the way he played, honestly. No, I thought he was great, but I thought he, you remember NBA Jam? Yeah. He was the first person I seen with the arcade version. So he used to bring me to his house. Like, hey, <laughs> and I'd end up staying there all day until the game started. His wife would bring me, you know, my mom was friends. Yeah. So, they, so I was like, no, nah, I want to stay and play the you know, video game. Because having the big arcade in your house was like, that was like everything to me. So Do you have one of those now? My dad got one for me, you know, really? shortly after. Yeah. That's pretty cool. Yeah. Did you ever beat Griffey? No, I've never beat him anything. Football, nothing. Nothing? I've never, no, not once. Oh my gosh. He's really good. Yeah. Yeah. Now, today, mm. if you played him, do you think because he's a little older, <laughs> you know, he's now he's put on a little bit of weight, right. he's out of shape, do you think you could take him? I don't think so. I think it's in my head now. Yeah. You know, you, you know, just your a big brother game. beats you all the time. Yeah. That's, that's, that's what it is. And Griffey Jr., big brother. Yeah. That's so cool. <laughs> all right. Uh, favorite sport to play other than baseball? Uh, for me, it was basketball. Yeah. But, you know, uh, you know, I was hoping I was at least 6'3", 6'4", because I could do Charles Barkley, you know, 6'4", 300 wide. The power rebound. I could rebound, yeah. you know, but 5'10", is not going to cut. <laughs> <laughs> so I had to give that dream up quick. Well, maybe your sons can, can do it. Ho hopefully, yeah, because my youngest is pretty, you know, he's bigger than my oldest, so hopefully. He gets and you're, you're trying to get him down on the post, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. We talked about that. Stop the, Steph Curry's cool, but you're bigger than him. <laughs> so, he is so, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Just that they're guaranteed they're the same weight. <laughs> <laughs> Favorite sport to watch other than baseball? Um, I'd have to say uh, I love what I mean. I love watching football because I don't know too many players know the names. But yeah. I love watching football just because those guys, if they learn how to play any other sport, they'd be an all star at it just because yeah. they're athletic. And I mean, not to mention, you know, you got to have a. I like the level of crazy they have to be able to hit each other like that with metal on. Huge, yeah, yeah. huge human beings running with metal. It's probably not safe, but they do it well. Not your thing? I mean, it's awesome. My son loves it. He's good at you know running back. So for me, it's cool because I can't teach him that. So yeah. I'm, I'm just like, you know, in awe that he's learned. He's a fan. Mm -hmm. Yeah, understood. Yeah. All right, growing up, role model. Role model. Uh, for me, it was my dad growing up. You know, I thought, you know, my dad was Superman to me. Uh, yeah. You know, so it was, for me, it was my dad. All right, proudest athletic moment. And this could be in Little League or anything. Uh, it was Father's Day. Um, I had two home runs, you know, and I had two boys. Mm -hmm. And I didn't even, you know, it was off of me. Uh, <laughs> even he beat us, but I, for me it was cool because I didn't even realize it was Father's Day or whatever. And uh, yeah, Trevor Hoffman was like, hey man, you need to keep those two balls. I'm like, nah, it's just two home runs, it's cool. We lost. And I was like, nah, man, it's Father's Day. Oh, is that cool. Yeah, yeah, you're right. <laughs> I knew that. So yeah, that was pretty cool. So if, it, if you didn't know, that means no one had given you a present earlier in the day. Oh, if, no, no, no. Day, yeah. Father's Day? Are you kidding me? That's yeah. not a day for no, anything. Yeah, that's right, exactly. No, wake up and go to work as usual. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, most embarrassing athletic moment. Embarrassing. Uh, I'd have to say, uh, shoot. 
There's been a couple. <laughs> you get, you kind of get numb to it. Uh, probably uh, my play from third to home. I don't know what happened. That was a weird time. I, don't, I had like a brain aneurysm, I think, in the middle of the play and thought the bag was right here and it was 70 feet away. <laughs> so, you know, I was trying to make something happen yeah. and it turned out wrong. You know what I mean? I, did, I was giving it all I got, but yeah. it looked terrible. It's but, the effort that counts. You know, that's, exactly. that's what I would go with. Hidden talent. Hidden talent. Um, I'm very strong. Like uh, lifting things, like you know, I want to. I think it's kind of what I'm gonna do when I retire. Like it's the one, you know, try to get strong as possible. Okay. Keep me occupied. I would never guess that you're strong. Well, you know what I mean. Like lifting. Like, no, I, no, like, I, yeah. I, I, I hear what you're saying. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I remember last uh, last year around this time, you decided to lift Rudy. Mm -hmm. You remember that? Yeah, yeah. That that thing went viral. It did. All right. Proudest non-sports accomplishment. Um. Proudest non-sports. I think. Uh, well, there's a couple, but I think my son when he was doing um. No, MMA and Jiu Jitsu. Mm -hmm. uh, his first tournament, he 